Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Just Hold On playing Dragon Quest XI Echoes of an Elusive Age. The last episode we did <clears throat> a lot of, like we, we, we basically went through the memory of when Dundrazil got attacked. We also helped our father's spirit escape the clutches of a despair-eating demon thing. Uh, or monster, whatever. We also got our power of Luminary back, with a lot of extra skill things. <laughs> so now I will never figure out what I'm gonna put my skill points into. <laughs> I'm still thinking about putting a lot of points into great swords, so I can use great swords, and also so I can get the sword mastery skills that are unlocked by unlocking both sides of the things. Both sides of the things, yes! But for today, we are going to go and make our way over to Octagonia and see if we can save a Jade. <laughs> I can kill all of these buggers, yes. They're too weak and pathetic. Get me going. Get that thing marked. Let's go and ignore the dragon because he's not that weak. Okay. There was a chest that I couldn't get earlier in the game. Or just things. I think there was a chest though, but I'm not 100% sure about that. There's in any case something over here that I could not get earlier in the game. So... Let's see if we can get it now, shall we? Yes. So, we have you over here. We also have some new enemies. Hello. Let loose with his fits. Doing no damage. They don't really do that much damage. Meanwhile, Rab goes Super Saiyan. Dirge of Dennisville. Um <laughs> Pearly Gates? Let's do it. And Savannah also goes Super Saiyan. As I get myself some beast boon. Um, I see something over there. <coughs> Victory will be ours. Wow. Savannah was missing uh, only a tiny amount of damage. Another day, another, day, another Vic. So, I suppose I'll have to run all the way around with this thing? Or no, over here. I will have to run all the way around to get that one chest out. Methinks. Anything over this way? No. There is an item in here, though. Molten globules. Ooh. Those are rare. Ba Let's go run around for a moment. Because I do think that I will need this mount if I want to get up there. <laughs> I was not sure if I was going to be able to get up here with this mount. Yeah, there was still a mount over here, but oh well. Ain't no matter a thing! Hello, Cyclone dudes. A blight from rock. And then we can go down here. I just think I'll do it like this, just in case that I don't run off. So that would be very unfortunate. Right. There we go. As I get a mini medal. Well, you know what? That's a. Uh, that is also very useful. How many do I have right now? Let's go and take a look. Uh, important items. Album de Medaille. I have one. <laughs> so I can technically get the spiked armor right now. If I want to. But then I'll have to go all the way over there. and I, I don't think it's worth it for the moment. Maybe it is though. You know, let's go over to Octagonia. It's going to enter Octagonia. And then I'll go and do... Um, 
Then I'll go over to the Notre Metro de Medai. And get my next reward. My next luscious reward! <laughs> As I run into a statue. Unless if the, the store is gonna rope me in. Watcher! You here for a bit of R and R like everyone else, eh? R and R? <laughs> Not likely. We've things to be getting on with. Seriously? You ain't locked to go near to let your hair down. Why else would anyone come here? Everyone's been miserable since it got all dark and that, right? Well, this is where people come to forget all that horrible stuff. To have a bit of fun. I met this girl on the road as it happens. She said she was headed here too. Cool, she was a looker. Dressed all funny she was. One of them martial artist types, you know. I was hoping to see her here, if I'm honest. A beautiful martial artist, huh? You don't think it could be... Rav! There he is. I thought he'd never show up. Well, it was nice talking to you. Maybe we'll bump into each other in town again, eh? <sighs> you took your time. Where have you been, you plonker? We got fun to be having. Come on. Here, hold up. <sighs> Octagonia. It has been a long time. Well, there's no harm in taking a quick look around town, eh? You never know. The lass he was talking about could be Jade. Alright, let's go on this map. Also, oh. Is there another one of these crawly dudes around here? Oh, hello. It's just finding out. I was hoping you would die from that. There we go. Hey, level up. Level up also. I'm getting 8 skill points per level up, which is freaking amazing. Hmm. I do think I want to go this way, though. I just want to get these sword mastery skills. They sound... They they, they, they seem very appetizing. <laughs> there we go. Let us go upwards. Let me just go... Like, look, I'm also... I'm, I think... Hmm, no. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I think I'm going to focus on going this way first, then see what this is over here. If it's worth it or not. And then we're going to go back down this way, so we can get... Some pretty decent skills. I have no idea. <laughs> I'm just going to be doing things, as I usually do. It's going to be putting random points into random skills, because otherwise I will... Well, semi-random. Because otherwise I will lose my shit trying to figure out what I'm going to put my points into. Uh, I don't think that there's going to be a mountable skeleton dude in here. A demon rider. Nah. Oh well, fuck it. Have I fought you before? Mabongus. I think I have. Things are beefy. Let's go for a crackle. And then time for a fan favorite Axis of Evil. Insulatal. Hmm. All right. <laughs> rab. Rab. Oh, rab. Ay, ay, ay. Let's see. What do I want to go for? MP1 wielding plus 20. It's pretty good. Caster sugar. Hmm. I think I got this one going now. Now we can see what this thing is. Magical might when wielding uh, plus 20. Okay. That makes a sizable amount of sense. Alright, let's go and enter Octagonia and hope that the story is not just going to begin 
Because I do want to go to the Notre Metro Demonite. Oh my god. <laughs> Didn't this place used to be funner looking? Ugh, and what's with that ugly, ugly statue? So tacky. Welcome to Octagonia. <sighs> A monster. Be on your guard. Oh, come now. There's no need for all that. You're in the new Octagonia now. There's no fighting here anymore. Only fun! All those tournaments they used to host. So uncivilized. The arena's a casino now, thanks to Booga. Best and most beautiful of the spectral fentanyls. <laughs> Why don't you step inside and chance your arm? It's just upstairs. Who knows? It might be your lucky day. This guy sounds like Kanji when you were hmm. <laughs> from Persona 4. It all sounds a wee bit fishy to me. Still, we better go and take a look. Jade might be inside. The casino. Well then. <laughs> but before we do that, let me go to uh, L'Académie de Notre Maître de Bedai. Zoom! Off we go! Now after. <laughs> I find it so annoying that, that they put you over here. It makes no sense to me. Oh well. It's also kind of amazing that this place is still just running even though the world's in a crisis. I guess Monsieur uh, Medai is... Yeah. Pretty powerful person or whatever. I don't know. Or just doesn't give a crap. I think it's that one. There we go. Spike to armor. Next is a miracle sword. Ooh. A miracle sword. Let's see. Spiked armor. More defense, less charm. Uh, thirty percent chance of reflecting damage taken. <laughs> now that seems like an interesting experience. So it's not better in defense, but this thing is also plus three. Does it do anything special? Fire and ice damage reduced. Yeah, and it's elemental damage reduced. Hmm. I think I'm gonna give it to him. Maybe. Well, no, I think I'm gonna give it to my. I think I'm going to give it to myself. You like the the platinum mail is not better, right? It is actually better. Hmm. Just less charm, but I don't care much for charm. Sure. Let me go rework that armor first. Then shall we begin? There. Level up. Action focus by six. That's pretty dang decent. Let's go and rework. Uh, oh boy. Let's see if I can find it first. <laughs> Let's see. Um, where is it? There it is. Spiked armor. It's not too difficult to make. Or not too difficult to rework. Right, flourish. So they pour off. And then once again the quadra bashers. As I am wont to do. <laughs> okay. I almost fucked it up right there. Almost, but not quite. Yes. Half next track is halved. It's a critical hit. Power of next track is doubled, you son of a bitch. That was a close one. <laughs> God save me. It's better. <laughs> it's a plus one, I think. 
Eh, I don't care, man. It's better. Let's go and equip the spiked armor. More defense and also reflect any type of freaking damage that I did. So, do I want to give you the platinum mail? No, because that's less defense. It does have all magic, like all elemental damage reduced by 12%, though. Hmm. Ah. Let's see. You could also technically wear the platinum garb. Or platinum mail. Right, I wanted to give it to you, of course. <laughs> What does the other garb actually do? Let me go and take a look. Does it do anything special? 5% uh, five spear start? Where's appearance when equipped? Okay, that's it. No, it's not amazing. Alright. Now I'm thinking about it. I think I should have a helmet that's going to be better for him. At this point. Uh, let's go for helmets. Because he can wear these helmets, yeah. Platinum head crown. Or head gear. Let's go and do it. <laughs> it cost me almost no money. Wow. I'm bloody rich. Okay, this is the poor. Okay, let's go for a double. How oh, am I? Okay. Power for next strike half. That seems like really. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I hate this. Why does it keep happening? Yeah, of course it's gonna happen. Fucking hell. It just keeps happening. It's so annoying. It is so ridiculously annoying. <laughs> I just forged a piece of platinum head here. Of course I did. Right, doesn't matter. It's an upgrade. It's not amazing, but it's an upgrade. And that's all I care about. Can I make a better sword for you? Hmm. Can I make another dragon's bane? Forge weapons. <laughs> Forge of empires. <laughs> Develop your own city. All right. Uh, for five thousand gold, I can make this. Sure. That's it. I've got the money. What's there be? Like, there's probably gonna be amazing upgrades in the next town or whatever, but... I don't care, man. I don't care. Hey, double quits. Nice. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna do a double. Oh, why am I? Okay, good. Triple. Oh, why am I? And suddenly it starts flying. Makes no sense. Well, actually, it does make sense because the the amount of damage, quote unquote, you're doing it always changes. It's not identical for every single hit that you do. Right. Let's go and give you a dragon's bane. There we go. Now you're like me. Only one level less cool. Right. Let's go over to... Uh... <laughs> Octagona, there we go. <laughs> Took me some time. Let me also go and rest up, I think, right? Yeah. <laughs> of course these people are getting... A hundred gold? Fine. I thought they were gonna overprice the living crap out of me, but... It's fine. I also wanna go and check out the shops. Just to take a look. That's what checking out the shop means. Uh, <laughs> Hello. Let's see, Steel Broadsword, Dragon's Bane, Black Blade, Worm Fang, Poison Moth Knife, Soul Breaker, huh. There's Boomerang, Rock of Rapidity, Sage's Staff, ooh. This seems like a pretty good thing. 
I'm gonna try to pronounce this. Obliteratorizer. <laughs> Inclined to cause critical hits. Huh. Interesting. Not too interested though, because I already have a pretty decent one. I do definitely want to get this one though. Yes. Ew, Rab. Yes. There we go. Oh, thank you. Thank you, my good sir. <laughs> Slobber. <laughs> a warrior shield. Hmm. Mental damage taken reduced by 5%. Feather headband. Manual mask. Disturbing turban. <laughs> Scholar's cap. Iron helmet. Warrior's helm. Cloak of evasion. Velvet cape. Iron armor. Dragon mail. A wizard robe. Hmm. Guess the shield is technically better, but meh. That's fine. Once again, I'm kind of waiting until I can get another book or something. Hello. Tough guy tattoo, strong medicine. And that's it. Okay. Right, let's go and save my game and make our way over to the casino. And see what is asked of me. Well, I spam the A button trying to save my game. It's a habit. It's cool. I feel alive. So it's over this way, yep. Maybe that sucks, but if you're dead suddenly getting a slot machine, you get like because you swing your way to the back here. Sure. Sorry about <laughs> Just wait right, uh, right here and I'll let you know when you're ready. There we go. I should at least try to do voices, maybe. <laughs> I've noticed that I've become exceedingly lazy. <laughs> okay. Welcome, welcome. We're so hyped to see you. I like, I like his freaking crotch pad. <laughs> okay. Hey there, handsome. This here's a token exchange token. Now, maybe you ain't heard, but this here casino ain't like no other places. Uh, like, like no other. Most of only interested in taking your tokens. We actually give you the darn things. That's how much we want you to have fun. And uh, and shucks, looks like you're you're in need of a token or two, honey. Here you go in the house. What? And remember, darling. This ain't just a one-time thing. You come back and see uh, uh, and see me anytime you need a top-up now, here. That's interesting. What can you win in this place? A love potion. Lots of question marks. Usable item. Cloves. Materials. Swords. Usable item. That's interesting. It's just like random usable items, random swords, random... I don't think so, no. A love potion. <laughs> of course they would sell it over here. Hello! This area place is such, uh, is such fun, the time just flies by. I wonder what I should do next. Take a... Take a tackle talk. If it isn't Illuminary himself, how long are you stand... I, actually, yeah, never mind. I'll tell you my passwords. If you promise not to tell the mayor, I'll slacking off. We should go back over there at some moment. Oh well, I'll... I'll have to do some research and whatever. I think after I'm done with this, I'll try to do that. Hmm? Who are you? Curious about uh, about what's through this store? Are you? Key? I bet you are. Well, I'll tell you. It's where the special roulette tables are. But it's for VIPs only. Sorry, but I can't let ju just any old riffraff in here. Of course, if you really wanted to go in uh, and you had, say, a love potion, I might consider it. Well, what do you say? Sure. Sounds like we understand each other. And the deal's sealed. Bring me a love potion and I'll send you straight on through. What's this? Where can you get a hold of one? Oh, you don't have to go far. You can exchange tokens for left potions right here in the casino. How much was it for that? A th uh, 10,000. A thousand? Yes, no, 10,000. So we have slot machines. Is that the only thing we have around here? Or... What's wrong with this pecking slot machine? It's like I put my tokens in, but nothing's happening! I'll sleep for five minutes, and the next thing I know is some drunkard idiots trying to stick coins in my mouth and pulling at my lever. I'd move if I could, but he's so far gone, I'd probably just give him the fright of his life. Uh, there's the bar over here. Or there's another bar over here. There's a dance party over here. There's two people fighting over here. What is this? So a slime quest. Are all of these slime quests? Some 
Crest in the machine number five. Huh. Is there are numbers on these machines. It's a slot machine. Minimum bet is 100 tokens. Wanna give it a spin? It's 10 tokens. One token. Okay. Let's go with the crazy one. Is it the one that I can press up and down to decide how many tokens to bet on each uh, spin of the wheels? If three or more of the same symbol line up on the row you've bet on, happy days! The number of tokens you win will depend on the type and number of symbols. Look at metal slimes and goodie bags are sure to win uh, to bring a smile to your face. Take a look at the traveler's tips in a menu to learn more. Okay. I see. So the minimum bet is a thousand coins. Or a hundred coins, right. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh my god, you can put so many coins in this. Let me go and do this to begin. Is it just random? It's random, yeah. It's random. There's nothing I can do with this. What a shame. You want to try again? <laughs> my favorite part of the game. Gambling. Metal modes? Metal mode? Metal mode. Metal mode. I have no idea what that is. Everything is a metal slime? You'll now earn double the tokens for any successful spins. So I didn't get anything. I just got... Well, I, I did get something, but... Please, please, please. No. Oh. Yes. What's that going to give me? Times 200? Ba, 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 ba. There's also 29 of these silver spins right now. Whoa. Whoa! That is a lot of money. Oh, whoopsie. Let's continue doing this. 28 spins left. Yes, please. Oh my... I was about to say. That would have been insane. I still get time to 100, huh? <laughs> ah, I see. I have a tiny feeling that I was exceedingly lucky. Which I do not mind at all. I kind of like it when I get at least some form of lucky. What is this? Token Drove! I have no idea what is happening. <laughs> I'm just making money and that's all I care about, I suppose. You receive a lot of tokens. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Man, if only uh, if only the the stop machine in the Super Adventure Island was this easy. Times six hundred. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I chose the correct stop machine. Sixty thousand coins. People are going to have to start kicking me out at this point. Wow. Just... Just wow. It's just going back on the bar. It doesn't matter, it's still times 300. Ba, 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 ba. I was so lucky with that metal mode. I win another 30,000 coins. Yes. I'm going to continue going until these silver spins are over. Who knows what I can get from the shop, if anything, really. Could also all be like kind of a joke and I don't really get anything from it. Who knows? You get more money! Why do I feel like this is really easy? Or I'm... It's either really easy or I'm ridiculously lucky. Could be either one of the two. Really. Hello? Queen slime? Oh, it's a reroll. Oh. Ah, yes. Times 500, because why the hell not? 
The thing is, there are so many different things where I can win or lose. There's so many, so many mechanics in this that I feel like I'm just getting ridiculously lucky. Or it really is a story thing. That at this point you can just get a lot of money. I don't know that. I guess I'll see. This, my friends, is how we get a gambling addiction. <laughs> it's the reason why game designers have stopped putting gambling games in their games. Wow. Another times 200. For another 20k. It just like pulls itself back. That does not happen in real life. Not that I know much of slot machines in real life. I don't do gambling. Only in games. Not with real money. Never. Kind of seems like a waste of money to me, personally. But once again, personally. <laughs> wow. That was like the first spin that actually just straight up failed. I just noticed something. I can stop this machine myself, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Hey, another triple seven. We're almost done with the silver spins, people. <laughs> and we can continue with the story. I'm pretty sure that some people will find this very satisfying to say. <laughs> just all of this money flowing into my pocket. I now have 284,000 coins, or tokens. So I get even more. Wow. <laughs> I'm kind of wondering what I'm supposed to do in this area, though. Because I needed to get the uh, the love potion to continue on, or so like the exclusive floor, or like the VIP floor, or whatever. I'm not sure what it's going to require me to do. I'm also really wondering what the, like, the, the hidden items, the question mark items are in the shop over here. So I'm kind of thinking if I still need the tokens after I go upstairs or not. I don't know. Free spins. You've won 20 free spins. Oh my god! <laughs> oh boy. You can spin for free! We heard you wanted more money. Now it's times 20, but it's time like what is times 20? Just like 210. Okay, so it's just 100 as I was using before. Okay. I think I'll continue going until the silver is over, I think. I wonder if I'm going to get the jackpot. And I'm also wondering wondering what the jackpot is. Because that would be pretty insane. Metal mode? No. 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 No way. I was about to say. Wait, it's still metal mode though. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Or is it just like a game to keep me stuck on these slot machines? That could be another thing though. That this part of the game is just made for you to continuously get stuck on these slot machines. Because you just win so much. Or am I just so lucky? It's either this or just like this big slot machine over here is just really good. It would make a lot of sense that it would be really good there. Need to learn when to quit, people. As you can see, I'm very inexperienced with this, so I just keep going until I... Yeah, this just feels like... like it feels like a waste for me to stop at this point. Because who knows how many coins I still need. Right? Or am I the only one who thinks that? More money! I win even more tokens. You know what? Nah, I'm done. I'm done. Yes, I'm sure. Yes, I'm done. <laughs> I'm, as, as nice as it was, I don't want to waste my entire life on that kind of stuff. Oh, wow. I don't even have enough to get some of these things. Wait, that doesn't make any sense. How much is that? Oh, yeah. No, no, I don't. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> That's a lot of stuff then. Let me go and get this last potion. Only one. So that's 10k. I'll just go and put it in the item bag. What is this over here? It's 50,000. It's fine though. Let's go and put that in my thing. A cypress stick. Mm. I see. <laughs> the question is will it always be something like this? That's the question. I'm going to discard it because it sucks. Let's just keep going for the moment, and we'll see. Hello. Kiki, <laughs> splendid! I can't believe it! <laughs> a love potion of my very own at long last! Ah, that earthly, tangy smell? I'd know it anywhere. It's the Peter's sweet scent of love itself. At last, the object of my affections is within my grasp. Ahem, congratulations, you are now a VIP. The most super light of... and select customers. Enjoy this special roulette table, and I hope you win big. You deserve it. Alright. I should have stopped my episode, which I think I'm gonna do right now, though. Once this got, like, once people start talking and have a chance to stop for a moment, I will do that. Ooh, we don't get many of your kind here. Well, don't worry, we'll look after you, if you'll just follow me. We will, in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this episode of this was playing Dragon Quest XI Echoes of the Lizard of Age. In the next episode, we're gonna go and deal with whatever the hell's gonna happen up here. Goodbye.